morning, brothers and sisters in Christ. Our devotion today is taken from The Desire of Ages by Ellen G. White, chapter 62, page 558. While this plotting was going on at Jerusalem, Jesus and his friends were invited to Simon's feast. At the table, the Savior sat with Simon, whom he had cured of a loathsome disease on one side, and Lazarus, whom he had raised from the dead, on the other. Martha served at the table, but Mary was earnestly listening to every word from the lips of Jesus. In his mercy, Jesus had pardoned her sins. He had called forth her beloved brother from the grave, and Mary's heart was filled with gratitude. She had heard Jesus speak of his approaching death, and in her deep love and sorrow, she had longed to show him honor. At great personal sacrifice, she had purchased an alabaster box of ointment of spikenard, very costly, with which to anoint his body. But now, many were declaring that he was about to be crowned king. Her grief was turned to joy, and she was eager to be first in honoring her Lord. Breaking her box of ointment, she poured its contents upon the head and feet of Jesus. Then, as she knelt weeping, moistening them with her tears, she wiped his feet with her long flowing hair. In what ways can you show honor to the King of Kings and Lord of Lords? Let's pray. Heavenly Father, just like Mary, I want to have deep love for you. And I want to honor you because I know that you are the King of Kings and Lord of Lords. I pray that you would show me how I can truly honor you. I know that you do not require my money or my possessions. But what you truly desire is my life. Help me to fully dedicate my life to serving you and living for you. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. May you have a great day ahead of you. Goodbye.